stay tuned. At the end, there's a giveaway. Hi everybody, welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Jamie B. Thanks for stopping by. So in today's video, we are going to be going over my 2021 goals for my channel, for my community, for all of that fun stuff and things I'm changing and updating on my channel, including like filming equipment and all of that fun stuff. So if you're excited or wondering what is coming up in 2021 for me, and my channel, then go ahead and keep watching. I know that this is a different kind of video, but I want to do a little bit more chatty videos and we'll get into that in a little bit, but also it is New Year's Eve. It's almost 2021. We are almost done 2020. Goodbye. See you later. Wish I never met you, right? I'm sure we're all feeling that way. Um, and I just wanted to kind of get on here and chat with you guys about big updates that are happening on my channel come 2021. Obviously not the first 2021 but like within the year within the beginning of the year a lot of things that i am changing updating and all of that so i thought i'd chat with you guys and just kind of like take it back for a minute away from makeup just for new year's chill if you guys are looking for a new year's eve look or makeup look i will go ahead and link the one i did right up here so you can check it out um but i just kind of wanted to chit chat with you guys and you know have some fun so grab a snack i know it's new year's eve you're about to be up till midnight 12:01 a.m yes and then i'm going to bed but grab a snack grab a drink let's get into what we're doing so let's talk about 2020 for a minute um there's not much to say in 2020 uh what has 2020 done to me you usually say for me <laughs> to me um it's actually been 2020 has been like an up or down kind of thing for me um it, it was a lot of down like my husband was unemployed for several months and you know we weren't able to do like the fun stuff that we do throughout the year but you know what we're alive we're healthy so like i'm not complaining i'm just letting you guys know what has happened in my life in 2020 um i really fell off of youtube for quite a while i was uploading like once a week once every two weeks, twice a week. It was really just all over. My original goal when I first started YouTube was to upload three times a week and then eventually get to five times a week when I had a little bit more time um, to invest in what I love. But it just emotionally, I feel like 2020 has really kind of drained me um, with the teleworking and the virtual learning and kind of just like everything going on. Um, but it's also kind of changed me like in that aspect. You guys don't really know me personally obviously but i have never been a very emotional empathetic person that's just kind of not really my vibe or never was my vibe but like 2020 has really kind of just like opened my eyes i don't know if it's you know because i've turned 30 and i'm just getting older i don't know if it's because my kids are getting older and i'm starting to like feel all these different emotions um but it's just really changed me and i've started like educating myself on different topics and stuff going on in the world um that i really kind of want to i do want to keep away from my youtube channel simply because that's like one of my main goals is to make this channel a community that you can come to and get away from like politics religion all of the mess all of the craziness like we we shouldn't ignore it those are important things but i just want you guys to have a safe space to come and just kind of get away from whatever's going on in your life whether it be you know depression anxiety um the hate of the world the weight of the world um and everything going on so that is my goal for 2021 primarily like there's little pieces there's little pieces but like my major goal is to basically just make this a safe space for anyone and everyone so i will not be doing any kind of scandals any kind of anything like that like we're not doing any of that we're washing that away i want to remove the drama from the makeup community um at least the much that i can do like i can only do so much on one person but maybe if i do it you guys can do it other youtubers and creators can do it and we can kind of just make youtube back to its fun like yes makeup self like i don't know about like drama channel stuff but you know it's always going to be drama but have a little portion of youtube that's just peaceful and like really just fun so on top of just like such a roller coaster ride of 2020 like i said i've just just been really educating myself on different things i am you know i've changed like a lot of the things that i believe in and how i believe them and how i view them and it's really kind of just made like my whole vibe and energy just a lot different in my opinion um i just realized being not having to be around such negativity i um, being able to control you know what i watch i don't 
have to watch the news if I don't want to watch the news and being I guess quarantined or locked in has really caused me to kind of just like do a lot of self-reflection so like those are all positive things I feel like came from 2020 um learning to be resilient learning to be stronger learning to deal and handle with anxiety and some depression and just like learning how to emotionally adapt and grow so i feel like this year for me was all about educating and learning how to do things for myself self-care how important that is and self-care is kind of like rolled into why i've started to do five days a week i love doing this i love taking the time out i love creating content and it's just really just changed like my whole attitude and my whole like just I guess look on life like just having that time like this is my self-care I know that sounds silly but like this is my self-care just having those hours to myself to sit down and film and do what I love and play with makeup and just like connect with you guys you know other adults because I'm stuck with four kids all day but you know it's just really become such a good and positive environment and like relief for me so I kind of want to make that the same for you guys I'm hoping that I make that the same for you guys I hope that my energy and my vibe is like just good and positive for you guys so you guys have a nice place to come even when you're feeling your worst like just come here talk to me if you can't reach me on the comments here or if it's more personal Instagram DM me um, I'm always there you can always reach out to me if you're struggling or whatever's going on we can talk like this is what I did YouTube for to build a community to build a family that can just hang out have fun and just laugh like just good vibes it's all I want for 2021 good vibes I know that word or phrase is played out but I really just want that I feel like I've learned to control how other things like in the world people work you know the news the TV whatever control my energy I've realized that um I talked about that in my unpopular opinion just like learning that absorbing so much negativity it creates me to think negatively so I just just want to have such a structured environment and like just full of nothing but positivity like I might complain about a product but what we're not gonna do is spread hate you could be anything in this world you need to be kind like that's just I've just changed like so much like you guys have no idea if you could have just known me like two years ago a year ago like this it wasn't who I was like I just didn't I was a very selfish person I'm gonna say that like it is what it is I was very selfish but I also was very absorbed with other people like you know what what were other people's issues what were other people's problems what did they think about me why didn't they like me why were people treating me the way they were and 2020 has just really made me believe and see that it doesn't matter like as long as I am enjoying my life as long as I am doing the best that I can then that's the that's all that matters do you know what I mean like just ugh. like I will definitely say that that is one of the greatest things is I feel like emotionally I have matured a lot with all of that being said I've kind of realized that I slacked off in 2020 and I tried to use why do I keep seeing 2020 I feel like I've slacked off when it comes to YouTube, which is my dream, my goals, my everything when it comes down to it. I just feel like I really slacked off and I, I was using what was going on this year as like a buffer as to why. Do you know what I mean? And then I had to realize that I was just in a, you know, bad headspace and it wasn't what's going on. Like, yes, what's going on around us is horrific, but I can control how I behave. I can control how I react to things. And that's what I had to learn as well. So now I'm putting like so much more effort into my goals and my dreams and just the things that make me happy. I am going to be changing like a lot of things because again, this year has really taught me that like, yes, my all over goal is makeup. Like I love makeup. The obsession that I have for beauty, all things beauty is crazy, but I love it. It brings me peace. Um, however, I have decided that like maybe I can cut back on the things that I buy um, when it comes to makeup, like trying to minimize on waste. So that's another change. And I just honestly, 2020 has really helped me to find my peace. I said 2020 again, but I'm serious. Like I have just really grown into what I feel is like my best self, my best adult self. So I'm just excited to share that with you guys because like I said, I look back a year ago and 
things were very different. They were just very different, like all up in here. So I'm excited. I'm excited for 2021. So these are going to be like things that are changing or coming up in 2021 or my goals kind of thing. So I am doing six videos weekly, every week, um, unless obviously something tragic happens, but I do not see that happening and I also film ahead of time to stop that. Um, I just have so much content and so many different things that I want to share and just create for you guys and just I just I'm so excited you have no idea I'm so excited. Um, also those videos will not be uploaded at 3 p.m. anymore and this will be starting January 4th the date I'm um, scheduling. It's gonna be 5 p.m. Eastern time now uh, just because I do find I get off at 3 o'clock so I find like sharing and tweeting and putting my link out there just kind of is very stressful for me. So again, something that I've learned is to change what I can when it comes to stressing myself out. So I'm going to be uploading those videos at 5 p.m. Eastern time now, Monday through Saturday. Obviously it's gonna be five videos in the week. And then I put my blooper video on Saturdays. If you've not seen any of those, I will put the playlist here check them out they're not like you know the funniest but i laugh when i make them so if i'm laughing when i make them they might be a little funny if you can laugh at yourself you're you're winning i also want to start doing more instagram posts but i find that my growth on instagram is just impossible and i'm gonna tell you why this was also one of my unpopular um opinions uh video where i just feel like instagram is not for me uh, Instagram is full of like Instagram models and people that over edit their photos and just like I don't I don't want to do that. So I'm just in between actually whether I want to really vamp up my Instagram versus completely delete it. So I need you guys to tell me below what do you guys think about Instagram um, post videos? What are your favorite things about Instagram? Do you not like Instagram at all? Do you would you prefer videos? Like what is the stuff that you really go for and not just on my aspect but really any content creator um just let me know what your opinions are on instagram because i'm just so like take it or leave it kind of person like i'll get on there for like five minutes and then i'm just like bye see ya also if i keep looking down i have my macbook down here for my notes because <laughs> this is a lot so i just kind of like mm, i don't know i'm just in between help me out here instagram yay or nay um also when it comes to the videos like weekly i think i'm going to change how i upload my videos so right now i just kind of jumped into five videos a week i know i know that was very random because like a month ago a month and a half ago like i said i was really just kind of half-assing it if we're being honest um but like ever since i decided like this is my jam like this is my thing this is my getaway this is my fun time my good space um i went right in i went all in and it's the thing is if you don't go all in if you don't just do it you're not gonna do it you will keep finding excuses on why not to do it um so but i want to with the videos that i'm doing obviously my bloopers are on saturdays it's the end of the week that's where i get all my blooper footage from is my videos throughout the week it's just fun thing to add for you guys just to kind of see behind the scenes of like how ridiculous it actually is to film like you should see if I could just upload full unedited videos I would but they would be astronomically large and way too long but I want to try to keep more structured uploading uh, and let me know what your opinion is on this if you guys are not into this then maybe I won't but what I'm trying to think of is like specific video days so for instance this is an example like makeup Mondays would be something relatively to do with a makeup tutorial makeup review first impression that kind of thing using makeup fully doing a look um and then like for example Tuesdays would be hauls hauls from anywhere fashion hauls jewelry hauls makeup hauls skincare hauls dollar store hauls whatever it may be and then so on Wednesdays would be like I don't I don't know challenges Thursdays would be like lifestyle whatever it may be um I just want to kind of do that where like every Monday I upload a makeup video every Tuesday I upload a haul video every Wednesday I upload a challenge video every Thursday I upload a lifestyle video every Friday I upload I don't know something else beauty lifestyle related but you get what I'm saying um I just need to like I'm I'm thinking that structured is the way that I want to go just because I want to kind of keep it like 
all organized for you guys so you if you come on here and like say you're only into my makeup videos then you can just go to those playlists and be like you know that on Monday Jamie is uploading a makeup video or you know if you're only into hauls you love my hauls okay Tuesdays are my days like I love her she's awesome but like Tuesdays are my video days because I love hauls but I don't care so much for makeup challenges that kind of thing so obviously give me your opinion down below it means the most to me um I do this you know for you guys too so let me know keep me in the loop let me know what you're liking what you're disliking unless you dislike me then just keep that to yourself just you know what I mean <laughs> My main goal, um, I've said this before, obviously from educating and learning from this year, is that I wanna grow a positive and fun community with positive and fun people. Like obviously we cannot be positive and fun all the time. We go through emotional stages and things in our lives, but like I don't want like nastiness and shade and drama and just scandals and I don't want any of that. So if that's what you like, you got the wrong person. Um, this is this is my main goal. This is what we're doing. We are revamping the beauty community on YouTube. All of us small creators, so if you're a small creator watching this, this is our goal. Let's change it. Everyone's like, oh, well, the beauty community is just full of, no, it's not. It is not. It's full of a ton of amazing, positive, beautiful people, and we just have to grab it and make the change. That's it. So I'm doing that. I'm doing it. As I say that, I just want you guys to know that I will be monitoring more comments. Um, I've been getting a lot of very weird comments from a lot of weird accounts. I think they're like bots or something, but they're naked in their picture and there's nasty videos on their account, um, which is to each their own, but I believe that they are bots. I don't believe they're actual people. So I'm going to be monitoring my comments and if they're nasty, they're gone. I don't care. If it's your opinion and your opinion differs from mine, that's completely different. But you, if you outright tell me I'm stupid, I'm dumb, or the person who commented was an idiot, I'm removing that and I don't care. You can be mad. That's what I'm doing. I know that a long time ago, that was a big issue. People were like, oh, they're removing the negative comments. Yes, I am. Yes, I am. Because that we're not here for this. The 2021 is not going to be the year we do that. We're moving past it. We're being kind. If we can't be kind, we're scrolling, thumbs downing and scrolling. Back to the video change. Um, on top of that, I would like to I would like to mix up my content. So not so much as like now I'm doing paintings on footage for you guys, but like still in that beauty range, but I also wanna kind of drift into lifestyle, doing like, you know, my morning routines. I wanna show you guys like room tours. I wanna show you guys the stuff that I use to film um, and all that kind of stuff. Just, I understand that it is kind of technically related to my channel, but I just wanted to give you guys a heads up that I will be changing up those things. I may be starting to vlog. I haven't really gotten enough confidence to kind of do that. That, like in public so <laughs> hopefully fingers crossed 2021 gives me a little bit more confidence when it comes to recording but just like different things like that um, not just solely makeup reviews makeup tutorials um, I do want to start doing more in-depth makeup tutorials so they may be longer videos I just haven't decided how I'm gonna do that or the way I want to do that but just like really in-depth step by step and just mix it up I just I love makeup I absolutely love makeup. It is my thing, but there's so many things that I'm interested in that I really think that you guys will love, like jewelry and fashion and shoes and just lifestyle stuff, you know, that kind of thing and just fun challenges. Like there's this chocolate, hot, super hot chocolate. Um, and you're like, you take a piece and you like, it's a game, it's a challenge or whatever. It's supposed to be like the hottest chocolate ever. And then there's a Dorito one. And I wanna try those on my channel and I don't want you guys to hate it, but I also just wanna be able to enjoy uploading that kind of content and not feeling like crap about it. So let me know the types of videos you like. Um, and you would like to see from me and I want to incorporate them. So a few more things that are changing are going to be my background. My background is changing. I know I just changed this and I just got this like the way that I like it, but I'm running out of space for things and not just makeup um, in general, just my things like <laughs> a lot of things. So I am changing my background. I don't know when I'm going to be doing that. I don't know when. Um, but I'm going to be and it's going to be a big change. Uh, I think I'm going to do the pack system. It's going to be pretty big and pretty bold 
but I think I'm going to definitely be doing that. Um, I just don't know when. Like I said, it's just going to take some time um, to get it all set up and figure out measurements and what I want and how I want it. I've been dabbling. I've been dabbling, but nothing crazy. You know I love Ikea. Another thing is I will be changing my lights. I know you guys don't really know what I film with, but that's what I'm saying. Like I want to start doing those videos, but I will be getting new lights soon. I'm keeping my ring light. It was very expensive. It was a beautiful gift for my husband. I also want to be bringing my family onto the channel a little bit more for you guys to meet and just basically be more personal with you guys. I want you guys to really get to know me and like just have fun. Like I'm a fun person. Like I mean, I'm not the best person, but I'm like kind of fun. I'm not as boring as apparently I thought. People were telling me I was fun the other day. But but back to the lighting. Um, I am getting new lights. Uh, I do want to get those in. These are kind of yellow for me and no matter what I do, like I have to really alter the film or the footage to get that yellowing to go away and it kind of really annoys me. So I'm gonna look into more lighting. And these are nice for a while. Um, I did pay like, I think it was like $120, not even, for these lightings. So um, I may get new ones. And if I do get new ones, then maybe I'll do a giveaway and I will ship these to somebody who is starting YouTube and can use them because I don't want to just throw them out. I'm also thinking about getting a new lens that's going to kind of blur the background because I like that um, and I've tried to do it on Final Cut and I'm just not. I'm getting better at my editing. Like you guys have got to notice the difference. If you go back two months ago versus now, like I got sound, I got like picture things, I got like fun stuff, but like <laughs> before it was, uh, it was a hot mess. But I do have Final Cut Pro um, and I'm just having a hard time blurring the background in the footage. So if you know how to do that, let me know. I know there are a lot of talented people on this app but I want to get a lens that kind of does that for me if I can so a friend of mine um she's a beautiful photographer and uh she gave me a lens idea so that I think I'm gonna get that but I will let you know when I do my filming thing I'll probably do a video for you um I do have a room tour eventually coming up in 2021 but I need to get this room together because when I tell you it's not big like you're gonna be like homegirl how do you even film in there like I I literally have like a four foot box that's what I'm filming in. Like it looks so big. It's not. I will show you. I'm also going to be doing a couple giveaways in 2021 because I know that this year has been financially stressful on a lot of people and I would really like to bless a couple of people. And speaking of giveaway, if you have made it this far, then you are lucky. So I am doing a giveaway. It starts today, New Year's Eve, and it is going to end on the 15th of January. I'm going to give about two weeks uh, for people to enter. All you have to do is be subscribed subscribe to my channel. You have to like this video, comment on this video, and I want you to comment your Instagram handle or a way that I can contact you. So when it is over, I can reach out to you. I also want you guys, when you comment, please don't just comment your Instagram handle, which is fine, but I would really like for you to tell me one positive thing that happened to you in 2020 or at least one goal that you have for 2021. Share some positivity in the comments for everyone to see and hopefully it kind of gives everybody just a better feeling and I bet you're wondering what it is. Well, let me tell you what you want. No, I'm just kidding. Let me tell you what it is. I am doing two prizes. So there will be two winners. The first winner will get a $100 Ulta gift card. I will mail it or email it however you choose. So the second one is going to be a box of makeup goodies, beauty goodies. There's some skincare stuff in there, some makeup, um, some different things that I've picked up just for giveaway purposes. And I collect them. I do it all of the time just so I can, you know, do a random giveaway. Um, I hope that is super fun for you guys. I hope you do participate again all you have to do is be subscribed like this video and comment your Instagram handle down below along with something positive that happened to you this year or something positive you're going to do in 2021 so guys that is it for today's video I want you guys to have an amazing New Year's Eve I want you to take time and just reflect and just figure out what the next step is. Um, I, I do know how stressful this year has been for millions of people. And I don't in any way want anyone to ever think that, you know, because I'm doing better or things have changed that I am dismissing anything that's going on in anyone's life. Don't ever take it that way. I do understand and I do feel um, compassion for those who are going through terrible times so just again if you guys ever need to talk like don't ever feel like you're alone um go ahead and reach out to me on instagram and we'll talk like i just i don't want you guys to ever feel so down that you know you just you don't feel like you can reach out i'm a normal person just like you so reach out to me talk to me 
let me know what's going on. If you just need to yell, just yell, man. It is what it is. But I want you guys to really just try to have the best time that you can um, and look and just know that good times are coming. Better times are coming. Um, we've been through it a lot. We've been through a lot. But I will tell you, this year has made all of us resilient, um, has made all of us stronger, has made us all realize that we can get through some of the worst things that have ever happened to us. So I love you guys. I want you just to try to enjoy this day. Happy New Year's. Just fingers crossed that all of my goals are achieved in the way that I want it to. I really appreciate all of the love and support from every last one of you who comment, who like, who share. I know it seems very small and very silly, but it does mean an absolute lot to me. And as always guys, make sure you're subscribed to my channel. I do upload five videos a week one blooper video on Saturdays make sure you give this video a big thumbs up and I will see you on the next one happy new year bye